The current trial that we've recently launched here at NYU Langone Health is the AstraZeneca trial. This is a trial sponsored by NIH and conducted in collaboration with this company. This takes a common cold virus, which can't even multiply in the human body. It's been disabled, and it serves as a vector to deliver one of the uh, COVID-19 virus genes, the spike protein gene. And that is delivered to the cells in, in the injection in the body into muscle cells. And then the body makes the vaccine protein from this DNA vector, the adenovirus. And that is a natural way to vaccinate. It mimics natural infection, but it's never, you can't get sick from COVID from it. It's not the whole virus, just one, one protein from the virus, the spike protein. And then the body, after the protein is made in the body, makes an immune response to it. The first steps with the new trial that we're launching presently, the AstraZeneca trial, involve getting all the regulatory ethics committee approvals that we need, uh, having the protocol reviewed by both FDA and our local institutional review board or ethics committee. Once we have those approvals, then we start reaching out to communities, to individuals, and educating and asking them uh, to consider participation in our trial. I believe that it's real important to participate in trying to find an answer here. And if I can help, I think it's a really important thing. I'm healthy, but I'm older, so I know I'm the kind of person that they need in the study. This is the final stage of testing with this particular vaccine, what we call phase three. We're really asking the most important question. Does the vaccine protect against COVID-19?